Attorney General. Candidate Stephen Scanlon is running unopposed in the Democratic primary. But the Republicans have fielded three candidates for voters to choose from. Our Anna Zalian spoke with those GOP candidates about how they would approach the job. The Attorney General provides legal advice to government officials like the governor and the state legislature and defends Idaho's laws in court. The current Attorney General Lawrence Wazden will appear on the Republican primary ballot and will face two challengers. Political newcomer Art McComer is a lawyer in Coeur d'Alene. If elected, his top priority would be filing lawsuits to limit federal intervention into what he considers state matters. Well, the Attorney General needs to be very active on behalf of Idaho, working with the other state Attorney Generals to push back against the federal power so that it's only exercising the powers it was originally given. Another priority would be changing the role of the Attorney General's office to allow the legislature to seek outside counsel. To look at the Attorney General's office and figure out how many positions we don't need and to assist the legislature in setting up a legislative council's office. Labrador is an experienced politician, having previously served in the Idaho State House of Representatives and the U.S. Congress, as well as having run for governor and spending time as Idaho's GOP chairman. He did not respond to our requests for an interview, but did participate in the Idaho public television debate, where he also discussed changing how the legislature gets legal advice on proposed legislation, recommending the attorney general not act as legal counsel for the legislature. I have thought that for many years. I proposed that when I was in the state legislature. But if things don't change, Labrador says the key is trust. If you have an attorney general who is trusted by the legislature, they will actually follow his counsel. When the governor asks me, then I am his lawyer and I give him legal advice. Not, I don't make his policy choices, I give him legal advice. When I'm asked by the legislature, the law says I'm required to give them an answer. My answer is the answer based upon the law, whether they like it or whether they dislike it. On the idea of a separate legislative council's office, the incumbent Lawrence Wasden says it's not up to him. It's up to the legislature because it's a policy decision. His previous experience includes time as the chief of staff in the attorney general's office before serving the last 20 years as attorney general. If reelected, his top priorities would include providing Idaho's government entities with legal advice and continuing his work prosecuting sexual predators. Protecting Idaho's children from sexual predators on the internet. We're spending a lot of time and energy doing that. You can find more information about the candidates hoping to lead this office and everything you need to know ahead of the May 17th primary on our website, IdahoNews6.com. Anna Azalian, Idaho News 6.